It was a regular day, like any other day. I had just gotten the mail, and I came inside because it was a little hot, a little humid, and I, you know, figured I'd get me a bottle of water. So I went to the fridge, pulled out a bottle of water. Then I realized I had left the water running in the tub, so I went, turned the water in the tub off, and then I came back. And when I came back, I realized that somebody had took a sip of my water. And it was a pretty good sized sip because you could see a big difference. The bottle was open, everything. And when I got there, there was nobody around the bottle of water. No evidence, no fingerprints, no nothing. But you could clearly see somebody had took a sip of my water. Do you like water? Yes, sir. When the last time you had some water? When I just came back from school. Uh-huh. Have you drunk any water since you've been home? Yes, sir. And where did you get the water? On the table. On the table? What kind of water was it? Just regular water. Was it my water? So you drunk some water on the table, but it wasn't my water. Okay. You may go. Did you drink my water? No? Do you know who drank my water? No, I didn't. <laughs> she done it. She lying? Now I know what you're saying. Really? Is it that serious? It's just a bottle of water? Yes, it's that serious. Because it's my water. Not only that, not only that, but you can't find this water nowhere else, man. They don't have it at Walmart. They don't have it in, in Sam's. I had to go to Savannah and go to Whole Foods just to get this water. It's very exclusive. And then when you do find it, it's like $10 a case. So yeah, I was upset that somebody drunk my water. Drink my water. No, sir. Are you sure you didn't drink my water? Daddy, it's not that serious. It is that serious. Match. <laughs> Did you drink my water? No, sir. Would you lie to me, Match? You don't seem so sure about that, Match. Did you drink it? hard to just say hey dad can I have some of your water I would have said no it's common decency to at least ask so you put your lips on another man's water it's just not right I was devastated moving forward what I'm definitely gonna do I'm gonna get my own little personal refrigerator put it in my bedroom and keep all my water in there and I want to see somebody take it out of there that's all I got to say